What's up everybody, welcome to Podcast Now, I'm Alex, and in this video I want to talk about the potential Scream TV show yet again. Now we talked about this a, a couple days ago, remember there was basically a rumor going around that a TV show is happening, it would be different from the MTV one, remember there was actually those rumors first that the MTV series would be coming back, then there was, no, then it's just going to be you know an, an original new show. Now I want to credit Beyond the Mask, I know that he did a video uh, on this and he had spotted rumors over on Reddit kind of going a little bit deeper and I believe the origin of this is that it was from the same person that did leak the idea that this show is coming back but it's important to you know remember to keep it in the back of our heads it's it, you know take it with a grain of salt we don't know for sure that this thing is real and again considering just three four months ago we were hearing that this show coming back would be mtv scream it's hard to trust one versus the other right we kind of just have to wait for it to go but the rumor is that this would be connected to sydney prescott now that on its own makes it sound very believable that on its own makes it sound something like that uh, you would think that you would do if you were trying to do a tv show but the rumor is that it's going to involve her cousin now i stopped kind of right there in terms of thinking about it because Am I saying it's, you know, that immediately makes it like it's not going to happen? No, no. I just think it's kind of unoriginal, right? When you already did Scream 4, a couple of us have maybe heard of that film, and then you would have the, the show be again on, on another cousin of Sidney Prescott. So here's what I would then read into, right? They clearly want the show, and I don't blame them. I don't think this is a bad thing, right? Or I, you know, I can understand why they would do it. They want the show to be related in some way to a uh, Prescott or Sydney, right? Because really all roads do, you know, go back to her. And I get that and I actually kind of respect that and I respect them for respecting her. I actually also think that I, you could very easily then have some sort of Nev Campbell appearance, like a cameo, not a, not a, even as like a, a reoccurring character, just literally like a cameo appearance that would get people in immediately and then you would hope to keep them, you know, after that, right? So it's all very understandable, but it's kind of like, well, number one, you're leaning very hard into that. Number two, it's very unoriginal. Um, you know, I mean, it's just now, you know, could the argument be made that we want it to kind of do its own thing? Well, what's tough, and I, again, I get that. I understand that line of thinking, and I don't think it's wrong. What's difficult is they have to play this very tight rope-like game where, you know, MTV Scream did want to be its own thing. I th I personally think that. I think the executives, the, you know, people kind of behind it, the very, the tippity top, they wanted to, you know, rely on Scream in the name, in the name Scream, in the phone call, in the ghost face mask, which obviously they, they did a different version of it. But I also then think from a more grassroots, like just, you know, on the ground level kind of thing for that show, they really did just want to be their own thing. They wanted to tell this teenage, you know, crime thriller story, you know, I mean, a whodunit kind of thing. And I think actually they did a, a pretty darn good job. Uh, you know, my controversial opinion is I, I do actually very much like the show. I like it more than I think most people like it, but I don't really think the show is Scream. So again, though, you, you get a difficult little thing where, all right, well, what is Scream? What makes Scream Scream? Ghostface, that's number one, right? The mask. Number two is probably Roger L. Jackson, specifically his voice as the killer, okay? But is there anything else? Well, it could very much be that it needs to relate or branch off in some way from Sydney Prescott and uh and again I don't really blame that I don't really think that's a bad thing I kind of agree I kind of think it's an underrated undervalued thing where I do think Sydney is more important to the franchise than some people think she is I, I really I just believe that so you know I again I I, I think I understand why you would want to have it be a relative. It's just, you know, do you have to have it be her cousin? But then also, you've done a lot to establish her family tree in the movies. It's hard to, you can't just retcon things. You can't just make up your own stuff. It's got to somewhat fit. So what's a very easy, well, a cousin. Everybody's got cousins. Everybody has multiple cousins. You know, you know what I mean? So that was really kind of the only thing I believe the other part of the rumor is that one of the cast members of the movie would make a would make an appearance or maybe they'd be part of the TV show. I think somebody like a Mindy or something would make a lot of sense to do that. I don't think you're going to get like a Jenna Ortega, you know, as a, as a Tara or a Sam, some, somebody big. I don't really think that would happen. So we'd probably be looking at like a, 
a Chad or Mindy or something like that. Um, and, and, you know, I, that would be kind of cool. I would actually, again, very much understand that. So, you know, it's building. Obviously, it's a little bit more than we knew, you know, a few days ago. But this is just still speculation. I, I, I do think no matter what happens, if there is a TV show, it probably will be connected to Sydney in some way. And, again, I don't think that's a bad thing. But I just think it's something they're going to have to be careful with because you don't want to just... I don't know, it's just immediately, that kind of gives me the sense that it lacks any originality. And if it wants to be its own thing, then be its own thing. If it doesn't want to be its own thing, well, I guess that's fine, but just be ready for people to kind of lay into you a little bit, right? So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Make sure, as always, you guys are subscribed to the channel. Hit the bell icon so you guys know when all these videos go up. We'll definitely continue to be uh, covering this. Obviously, if this show becomes a real thing, I'll be covering, you know, every single episode. That should be a lot of fun. I'm kind of rooting for that to happen but we'll do more uh, if you guys want to follow me anywhere else all of my social media along with our patreon and youtube memberships are in the description below thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you all on the next video